Hey what's up everyone and welcome to Daily Code Buffer. In this video of JS Buffer, we are going to see the from function of an array. So from function is a static function of an array which is used to create an array from the array like object. So if I see the example over here, you can see that it says creates an array from the array like object. So suppose if you take one example constant array equals to array dot from and in this particular function we can pass the array like object so suppose if i'm passing the string which is just a collection of characters so if i say a b c d over here so that means this particular from function will convert this a b c d string into an array which is containing a single individual characters so let's print this console.log array over here okay and let's print this and here you can see that we are getting the array of characters over here. Similarly, if we have the string with numbers, suppose 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 over here. And if we want to convert this particular to array of numbers, then you can see that we are getting the array of characters here over here. But this from function also have one more parameter that will take the entire map function. So what it will do is it will allow us to do a mapping for those particular elements. So let's add one mapping over here. What we'll do, we want to convert this particular elements individual into a number. So we'll do value. It is the input parameter. We will using the array function and we want that to be number. So if you see this, we just use the mapping function over here, which is taking value as input parameter and it is converting that particular value to number. So let's run this again. And here you can see that we are getting the array of uh, numbers now. So generally this method is used when you have to convert a particular string or particular array or particular other type of functions like set or map to an array. At that time this particular array dot from function is been used. So suppose let's take one more example. I'll just take constant numbers equals to. I'll just add a few of the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 2, 3, 5, 5, 6. Okay. So these are the numbers available in an array. And you can see that these numbers contain duplicate values as well. So what I want is I want an array that contains only unique characters or unique numbers. Okay. Inside that particular array. So what generally we do is we use the for loop and we just remove the duplicate numbers. Or instead, what we can use is we can create the set out of this and we can convert that set to particular array. So let's do that way. Let me just do console.log and if I just do new set over here and I'll just pass the numbers array over here. So what it will do, it will just convert this entire array to set and set only contains the unique characters. So only unique values will be available here. So let me just remove this and let me clear the console as well. And let's run this again and here you can see that this entire array has been converted to set and we are having only unique values over here but i want the array not the set so i can use the array dot from function to convert this set into array and here you can see that we will be getting the array with the unique values available from this array which contains duplicate values. So this is just a one scenario where we can use array dot from function. There are a lot more scenarios where you can use array dot from function. So that's all in this quick tutorial for array dot from function. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for the upcoming videos. I will see you in the next video. Till then, happy coding. Bye bye.